Library Services is pleased to present the Digital Library. Students and staff can check out up to three ebooks or audiobooks to read or listen to on any device. To access the Digital Library, first go to the portal. From the portal, you will look for the blue folder labeled Library Find a Book. Click on it, then choose Digital Library. Once the Digital Library opens, you can choose to explore to find books, look at your shelf to see any books that you've already checked out, or click on me to look at badges and other items that you have added. Click Explore to look for books. You'll see a variety of collections already created, including Read Along With Me stories that will read aloud while students read alongside. We also have Spanish reads. We have simultaneous use Spanish titles. Anytime you see simultaneous use, this means that all students and all teachers can look at the books and check them out at the same time. Once you find a book that you're interested in reading, click on that book. You can choose to borrow it, read a sample, or you can add it to a wish list to go back and check out later. Click Borrow to borrow that book. Once you have successfully borrowed the book, it will open in the main screen. From here, you can choose to continue reading the book, or you can close out and go back to borrow another book. Clicking on the bookmark on a page will save that page so that when you come back, it will be ready for you to start again. Click on the three lines at the right-hand side to select different reading settings. You can increase the font size. You can also change the background color. And you can use a variety of different fonts to choose the font that would help you best as you are reading. Click Done to continue reading the book. Simply click on each page to the right to turn the page to continue reading. Close out and click on your shelf to go and see the books that you have checked out. Here you have a variety of options. You can open the book, click on Options, you can renew your book, return the book, or even send it to a device. You can also see any notes and highlights that you've added and add it to a list of books you love or books that you want to read. You can also mark it as done. If you want to go and see additional books to check out, click on Explore to continue exploring books. At the top of your shelf, you can see any books you've put on hold, your lists of books that you have, and any activity that has happened on your account. On the three lines at the top right of the main page, you'll see that you can add additional public libraries that you are a member of. You can also look at your device settings and language settings for the digital library. When you are done, if you are working on an iPad, you want to make sure that you sign out. If you are on your own device, you may stay signed in, and the next time you open Sora, it will take you back to the home page. And this is a brief overview of our digital library. If you have any questions at all, we hope that you will contact Library Services or your campus librarian. We are always happy to help.